Hey everyone, thanks so much for tuning in. Today I have another Dollar Tree haul for you guys. And I'm sorry about the different location. I am having construction done on my home. So some of my videos are going to have to be in this room. Anyway, let me show you what I found this week at Dollar Tree. So what I am most excited about are these clear plates. I've seen so many tutorials where people have done food safe, um, images on these plates and I've been dying to try it but Dollar Tree only carries the ribbed ones so I was really excited and really surprised when I found these so I did pick up a few and I do plan on filming a few tutorials on how to make some food safe designs. I purchased these eye stickers they come in different patterns and different colors I liked this one and I think it is just so perfect for Halloween and adding a little extra flair to your costume I always get really really happy when they bring in things that you can use if you have an Etsy store and this week I found these white tags with strings so if you are considering selling merchandise or shirts this is a great way to tag it and it brings 30 for a dollar I also purchased these mailing seals in gold. It was such a nice gold. You can use them for many different things, especially DIYs. So I'm really excited to incorporate this somewhere. Now that the stores are fully stocked for Christmas, I fell in love with these ornaments. You can unscrew the bottom and put whatever you want inside, like newborn pictures in there, or little keepsakes, or just make these into snow globes. I was lucky enough to have a Dollar Tree that stocks up on clothing and stuff. So I picked up this knitted hat for the cold weather. And I'm not gonna lie, they are pretty thin, but I'm actually picking this up for Halloween costume. And I also got this pack of gloves and it brings two pair. So this is pretty nice if you are going to use it for Halloween or if where you're from, it doesn't get too, too cold. My daughter is at that age where we wanna try and teach her the ABCs and one, two, threes and shapes and colors. They're Sesame Street themed cards and they come in all different little lessons and it actually teaches you exactly how to use them. So if you have no clue how to introduce this to your child, it'll give you specific instructions and you can also watch YouTube tutorials on how other people use these. Of course, I picked up more of these mirrors. I'm sorry if you guys are getting sick of these tutorials, but I wanna pump out as much as I can before the season is long gone and you guys cannot recreate this at home. So forgive me while I overload on the skull mirror DIYs. <laughs> I've seen this jewelry organizer at Dollar Tree a thousand times, and for some reason, this one time is when it caught my attention. I think it's actually really great for a dollar. It brings a little holder up top for your necklaces, and then the mesh on the very, very top to hold your earrings, and then a little bowl on the bottom so that you can place your rings or any other loose jewelry. So per usual, I always get excited when I see name brand, especially when it's decent size name brand. So I got the Lysol Toilet Cleaner and Dawn Hand Renewal. And it's actually coming in pretty handy for me because as you can tell, I'm staying somewhere else. So the fact that we can bring these little, sometimes I pack the small laundry detergents for my husband when he has to go away. It's just a lot more convenient than buying the full size when traveling. I purchased these two e.l.f. lip glosses and I'm actually pretty impressed with the color. Usually Dollar Tree will carry e.l.f. all the time, but it's never stuff that's in season. So I was pretty impressed when I saw that they had burgundy and natural, which is very fall and warm colors. I had to pick up both of them. And they had other colors, but these are the two that I think would look best on my skin tone. I purchased more of these Sassy and Chic nails and I absolutely love this pattern. I stopped using the Sassy and Chic for a bit because the patterns that they were bringing out, I didn't like them. And since they only bring 12 to a pack, it's not like you can take out the designs that you don't like. So I'm really glad that they started bringing out nicer designs. So I'm really, really happy that these designs are actually adorable and I like every single nail in the pack. I purchased this LA Color Pout Lip Gloss and I'm going to be completely honest with you, it was a fail. I do not recommend this. I would not try this again. The only reason I kept it around was to show you guys. I wish I would have taken video of when I wore it, but not only did it crack badly on my lips, but it was impossible to get off. I had to use makeup wipes, regular wipes, and it just honestly just cut up my lip because it was so drying. I do not recommend this. Please do yourself a favor, do not pick this up. And the sad part is, is that I was so excited to see this because so many people were raving about them in the Dollar Tree groups. And honestly, this is a 
Anyway, y'all, thank you so much for joining me. Thank you for dealing with my many changing backgrounds. And if you like these videos, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up. It really helps a girl out. Thank you so much and see you next time.